as a generation that was born in a technologically advanced world where countries are interconnected with just a click of a button. The idea of culture among pre-adolescent children can seem like an alien concept. To check this threat of cultural extinction among current and future generations, this program aims to imbibe a sense of cultural and national identity. We discover that children are not responding to their, to their culture. They are going away from the culture. And uh, most of them cannot even speak their language, their mother language. You know. And because of the uh, urbanization and globalization, the Nigerian culture is actually fading away. So this program is to arrange from the youth for them to start to, to get enlightened. As they are uh, little children, so we have to teach them what is going on in Nigeria these days, how to live, how to work, how to do everything in life. We discovered that public libraries in Nigeria is not what it's supposed to be. So we put together this program to bring in our children to teach them some kind of innovative skills that will make them independent on their own. And also to improve on our culture that has been put on the ground because most of our children don't even know what our cultures are. It's very necessary for you to know your culture and your language because it helps you a lot. Like me, I'm from an, in the eastern part of Nigeria, so I know my culture very well, I can speak my language. So it helps you to communicate wherever you go to. They help us to understand our language. Like me now, I live in the city, so I don't actually understand or know many things about my culture. But as I'm here now, they have taught me everything about my culture. In addition to this, and in furtherance of achieving sustainable development goals one and four, no poverty and quality education, the program also seeks to empower children through hands-on learning and pep talks to prepare them for an independent future. Dennis at Digon Louis, NTA News.